hi guys welcome back to the channel today in this video i'll be showing you how to make this simple kaftan bubu gown so this is the fabric that i'll be working with for this project and the length of this fabric is 60 inches and i have three yards of this and i'm going to be working directly on this fabric i will not be using a pattern paper for this tutorial so to begin i'm going to be folding it across the three yards towards the wrong side so this is the first folding and then i'm going to fold it again and that's because i'm going to be cutting the front piece and the back piece together so after folding i'll just go ahead to pin the fabric down so it doesn't move because the fabric moves around a lot so doing this will just make it easier for me to work with so after pinning i'll go ahead and turn my fabric towards the other side so right now it's lying horizontally and this folded part right here is going to be for the center front and center back while the other end that has the open side is going to be for the side front and side back so like i said the full length of the fabric is 60 inches and if you're very tall you can use it like that but i'm not so i'll be using 56 inches okay so now it's time to start working on the kaftan and i'll begin with the neckline so for the neck width i'll be using 3 inches and for the neck depth i'll be using 1.5 inches because i'm cutting the front and back together i have to begin with the back neckline first before moving to the front so after marking the two points i'll just go on to connect them together and then move on to create my shoulder slope and to do that i'll be moving to the other end of the fabric and i'll be coming down from the top by two inches so i'll be marking two inches downwards and then i'll connect that point to meet the neckline i just turned the fabric the other way so you can see how i'm doing that so i'm bringing in my long ruler and i'll be connecting that point in a slant to meet the neckline and once i'm done with that i'll go ahead to cut along that line and i'll also be cutting the neckline as well so i turn the fabric to the other side again because i want to cut open the folded parts after which it's time to measure along the shoulder slope so i can know where the arm opening will be so just measure the length of the shoulder slope and also measure the length on yourself so you can know where the arm opening will be and when you get that point you're going to measure around your arm just like i'm doing and whatever measurement you get you divide it by two and that's what you'll be marking down from the shoulder slope on the other end of the fabric now from that point i'll be coming in by half an inch you can come in by 0.75 or even one inch i'll just bring in my scissors to create a small notch like so and then i'll face my scissors downwards and i'll start cutting away half an inch from that point all the way to the end once that's done it's time to remove all the pins and take out the inner piece so this inner piece i'm taking away will be for the back while the one left on the table is the front piece so now it's time to create the front neckline and i want a v-shaped neckline and i'm going to be using eight inches for the neck depth while the neck width remains the same so i'm marking eight inches downwards along the center front and then i'm going to connect that point with my ruler to meet the neck width so you can see how i'm placing the ruler in a slant i'm going to draw out the line and then cut along that line to create the v-shaped neckline and that's it guys we're done with the cutting of this kaftan now it's time to start stitching so the stitching process of this kaftan is quite simple first i'll begin by finishing off the neckline using a bias tape and i'll be doing that for both the front and the back piece so after stitching here's what we have now i'm going to iron around the neckline after which i'll be placing the back piece on top of the front piece right sides facing each other and then i'll go on to stitch along the shoulder slope using half an inch sewing allowance so i'm just pinning everything down first before taking it over to the machine to stitch both sides and when i'm done this is what it looks like so after stitching down the shoulder slope the next thing to do is to finish off the arm opening and I'm going to do that by folding it inwards towards the wrong side. And I'm going to be doing a double folding. So I'll fold it once and then fold it again and then stitch it down. And I'll be doing the same thing on the other side as well. So here's what it looks like after stitching and here's the other side. So we're almost done guys. Now I just turned my fabric over to the wrong side. And I'm going to be stitching the sides closed using a half inch sewing allowance. I'll do that for both sides. 
And lastly, I'll be finishing the hem of the kaftan by folding it towards the wrong side twice. And once that's done, the gown is ready. And here's the final look guys. You can see that I went back in and added the green part or the material to the sleeves. I didn't film it because that was just a personal preference and I had to wear it the next day and it was very late. But yeah, that's it for the tutorial. If you stay to the end, thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think in the comment section below and don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you in my next video.